So this story revolves around uh, New Jack in XPW. So as his theme song suggested, New Jack came across as a natural born killer and wasn't someone to cross in wrestling. If you did, there'd be consequences. At ECW's Living Dangerously pay-per-view 2000, New Jack wrestled Vic Grimes to a brutal no contest. At one point in the match, they were supposed to both fall from a huge 20-foot scaffolding rig onto tables below. Yeah. There was some miscommunication between the two, with New Jack falling and grabbing at Grimes to make him follow. Grimes, who was a giant of a man weighing over 300 pounds, landed directly on New Jack's head. Brain fluid immediately leaked out of Jack's nose after falling. He suffered a skull fracture and has been blind in one eye ever since. Shit. Let's fast forward. There was major heat directed at Grimes afterwards from Jack. So as I understand it, what had happened was they were both supposed to go off. Mm-hmm. Grimes like second doubted himself or second guessed himself. Yeah. So New Jack went and New Jack went, well, I can't go by myself. So I'm grabbing Vic to come with me. God. And had Vic Grimes just gone at the right time, there's a very like a strong likelihood that this injury wouldn't have happened. Yeah. So New Jack was like, well... You basically, even though it was him that grabbed him to pull him off, if you caused have, me yeah. to do that. So he then obviously held a grudge. As I said, that's not the man you want holding a grudge oh. against you. Okay? So, as I said, there was major heat directed at Grimes afterwards from Jack, with the two somehow getting booked in the same match again in a scaffold match for XPW in 2002. Jesus. Looking for revenge, Jack, for real, tasered Grimes high above the ring... And then sent him flying 40 foot off the scaffolding platform they were on through a load of tables. And Vic Grimes barely hits any of the tables in the ring. So I'm talking about like three, four tables stacked up high in the ring, all over the ring. And they're fighting on a platform above it. He throws him off the side and like you see Vic slightly hit the ropes as he comes down. Now, what after he was interviewed about it down the line, because it looks like it was just, oh, that was close. Yeah. New Jack said, no, I was trying to kill him. I was trying to throw him beyond the ring. I didn't want him to land in the ring. I was trying to kill him. Stop it. I threw Vic over them table. I was trying to throw him. I wanted him to land on a post, the turnbuckle post. I was hoping that he landed head first on top of that pole. But they had moved the, they, they had moved the scaffold back about another five feet before when they were building the, the scaffold over the ring. And I threw him as hard as I could, and he hit the rope and bounced back in the ring. I wanted that to hit the floor. I wanted him to die. I ain't got no love for Vic, no, because he's a fucking idiot. It was attempted murder. New Jack tried to throw him, so he landed outside the ring. And believe it or not, the only injury I think Vic Grimes got from that was I think he broke his ankle, Jesus. which is the least of your concerns on an attempted oh murder attempt. So this is why I find New Jack legitimately terrifying. Okay. Thank you, everyone, for the support you guys have shown us so far. It means the world to us. Holly, what do we want to remind the people? Um, Don't forget to like, subscribe and ding the bell for notifications.